Where did Jesus announce the coming of Muhammad? Peace and blessing be upon him. Well, first of all, I do not quote Bible. I say to you that in your scriptures, there is such and such evidence. But I don't use the Bible as a proof because I'm not a Bible authority. But I say in your scripture, there is such and such a proof. If you will read carefully in your Bible, you will find that when Jesus Christ was in the upper room in the Garden of Gethsemane, you remember that story, don't you? He was with his disciples and they asked him, Oh, Rabbi, what shall happen to us when you leave us? He said, Fear not, for I will send unto you the Comforter, and you will know him because when he comes, he will speak of me. And he will not speak of himself, but whatsoever he hears from God, that shall he speak. And your hearts and your minds are not prepared, but so be it. When he, the comforter, comes, he will make all things plain for you. And what he receives from God, that shall remain with you forever. Now these are four prophecies that Jesus made to his disciples. What's the first one? He will speak of me. In the Quran, there's a chapter called Maryam, which means what? Mary. God revealed to Muhammad the Quran and one of the 114 chapters is named after the mother of Jesus Christ. Now is that speaking of Jesus Christ and confirming him? Yes. In that chapter, it speaks about the birth of Mary, it speaks about the birth of Jesus Christ and all of his miracles and his life and his worship and his sacrifice. And God said clearly to us, neither was he crucified nor was he killed. Now don't you think that in a book that God revealed to Muhammad وسلم, if he mentioned Jesus' mother, Mary, don't you think that God should have named one of those chapters after Muhammad's mother? He didn't, because that wasn't necessary. It was necessary to name one chapter after Jesus' mother or Jesus, because Jesus said what? He will mention me, he will confirm me. The Quran did that. Second thing, he said, he will not speak of himself, not words from himself, but whatsoever he hears, that shall he speak. Brother, can you recite the ayah? أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وما ينطق عن الهوى إن هو إلا وحي يوحى علمه شديد القوى ذو مرة فاستوى وهو بالأفق الأعلى This verse of the Quran says concerning Muhammad, peace and blessing be upon him, that Muhammad, he does not speak from his own feeling, but whatsoever he hears from Almighty God, from revelation, inspiration, that is what he speaks. Is that what Jesus said? Thirdly, he said, your hearts and your minds are not prepared now, but how be it when he the comforter comes, that counselor comes, he will make all things plain to you. The Quran says, verily this is a book that makes all things plain and clear. Is that what Jesus said? The fourth thing, he says that whatsoever he re receives from God, shall remain with you forever. The Quran has been intact as it was revealed for 1,424 years since it was revealed. And that's what Jesus Christ said.